Fault Lines is about earthquakes, basically, and that's what I was asked to create a show about. Rather than sort of focus on the horror of an earthquake, it focuses on the human story and human response to an earthquake. And that's made all the more personal by the fact that all the performers have been through the Sichuan earthquake of 2008. And I was in Christchurch for the Christchurch earthquake in September 2010. So that's where this has all come from, really. The idea of absence within the show is quite strong. Um, buildings not being there, people not being there. Your body goes through this incredible experience and that's in your nerve endings and muscles and it, it, that will never ever go for any of us. There's a smell to the piece, it's dust. So there was an image that really inf informed me of a couple in uh, Bechuan had just got married when the earthquake happened. So there's, there's incredible photos of this couple in full bridal attire, but they're covered in dust. It looks like it's snowing with all the um, rubble dust that's falling. We've put haze into um, our lighting, so to create an atmosphere and primarily to give the audience a sensation of the dust that rises up in the wake of an earthquake and all the rubble falling in those broken buildings. Primarily I'm just working off my instincts and feeling my way through the piece as well as a whole journey and crafting a rhythm through it for the audience as well of where you need to shift gear a little bit more or pull something out. I purposefully slow things down at the end, it's almost like Buto, the speed of the final dance, which I find quite mesmerising. So. <laughs> uh, and on opening night, I'm really just curious. I watch the audience more than I do the stage. I try and read how they're responding to the piece. I never get nervous, I'm just curious. 